I'm Luke Sewell. I'm a rising senior at the New Mexico Institute of Mining Technology, and I'm working in Professor Yang Xiaohorn's lab. So the main goal of my project was to develop a novel class of oxide catalysts to reduce noxious chemicals in the atmosphere known to cause cancer. This involved trying to link electronic structure to the catalyst to the selectivity towards these volatiles. I'm Kartika Kiraju. I'm a graduate student in the Electrochemical Energy Lab. One particular issue that I've been trying to address with my graduate thesis is that of air pollution. Every year there are about 6.5 million deaths worldwide due to air pollution. And just within the United States, the numbers are close to 200,000, which is pretty alarming. So this is an IR spectra. So what I've been doing this summer involves flowing gases through a plug-flow reactor with the catalyst inside, and then I've been analyzing the gases using an IR spectrometer right here, and this is our spectra. So right now I'm just measuring the concentration of CO2 in the cell. I've been working on oxidation reactions for volatile organic compounds. So in the lab we have two basic parts. So we look at synthesis of new materials, and on the other hand we look at reaction mechanisms. And with the background that Luke had, he fit right uh, well in with the synthesis part, we're using different characterization techniques. He's been exploring these novel set of oxide compounds. In order to address the issue of removal of toxic gases such as carbon monoxide, nitric oxide, volatile organic compounds, we've been trying to develop new catalyst materials. So Luke has taken lead of the project to set up the gas lines for these new organic compounds, run the calibrations, and now he's been producing pretty impressive results. I decided to join the lab because the group seemed like a family and I was really interested in catalysis. Now we're loading more catalysts into our in-situ reactor. Luke is an incredible team player. While he's been working on his own project, he also has been finding time to help other people in the lab, characterizing their samples, synthesizing new materials for them. So he, he has a never say die kind of attitude while he's always up for everything that comes along his path. To classify the, the crystal structure of these catalysts we were synthesizing, I learned SEM, scanning electron microscopy, to image the different morphologies of these catalysts. And they're skills I've used in the past, but I've definitely learned more about them and they're skills I'll continue to get better at as my career progresses. So it was a really good choice.